into it compatible with the converter cicada stole. You know, now that I've actually experienced this whole time travel thing, I think I understand it a little bit better, which makes me understand Thon's plan less and less. Why would he send Nora back to create a new cicada only for a newer cicada to appear who's harder to stop than the one Nora created? Ralph, can we get away from Thon's plan and try to stick to our own? Yeah, yeah, I, I just... I feel like there might be an answer in this timey-wimey crap that could help us solve this. Nora, where would you find this hyperconduit in 2049? Probably Allen's laboratory. Allen's won a Nobel Prize for quantum engineering. Allen's? As in Sebastian Allen's? Yeah, do you know him? He's a true genius. <sighs> a genius, you say? The guy couldn't even stay awake through a single physics lecture. In fact, I'm pretty sure if it wasn't for his very smart, very considerate college roommate lending him notes, helping him study, he wouldn't have made it through his finals. Nobel Prize, my ass! Yeah, he knows him. You know what? It doesn't even matter. Life's too short, and I'm not about to spend my life worrying about little Sebastian Allens. I found him. Looks like he's been renting a warehouse somewhere on the south side. And then he retrofitted it with fiber jewels technology to test out his experiments, including one bleeding edge hyperconduit. I'll go get it before Grace can. Right behind you. I, um, I, I think you should sit this one out. What? Why? Nora. Your connection with Grace, it puts you in too much danger. I mean, we don't... I think it's best for you to just stay out of the field until we stop her. So what, now I can't help the team at all? Nora, please, understand. Look, you would be much safer here. All right, I'm here. No sign of cicada. Great. Grab the conduit and get out of there. I think I got something. Barry! She's already got the conduit. And she blew up on this warehouse. Grace has everything she needs.